If only there were grades for getting around the system rather than staying in it. Well, our school hacks can still help with getting your life school balance just right. Check them out and put them to good use. There is no way Mike's gonna miss an episode of his favorite YouTube show. A blogophile like him doesn't care where nor how he's gonna get his daily dose in, as long as his trusty gadget is by his side. But part of the fun is watching with someone you could then discuss with. Good thing Ashley here is a fellow fan. Okay, so maybe Mike's phone doesn't want to stay put. That doesn't make for a very convenient watching situation. What if he just leans it against these notebooks? That didn't work. Fine, let's try this. Nope. Come on, man. Why can't you just stay still? I've got something we could try. Now the phone's definitely not going anywhere. Oh, come on! What am I supposed to do now? Think, Mike, think! You can do it! Paper clips? How are they gonna help? You only need one! Still don't know where we're going? Check it! Bend half the paper clip like so. And ta-da! Put the phone down carefully, and your personal movie theater is ready for action. I don't believe my eyes. It actually worked. Looks like Mikey's gonna go to an actual movie theater soon. And not alone, either. Crib sheets. Hmm. The whole point is that they have to be inconspicuous. What's the best way of achieving this? And of actually having them be there when you need them? Don't worry, Natalie. We've got a plan. <sighs> Try this hack with your best friend. Just tape your notes to her back and use her hair to hide it. Yup, just like that. gonna ask Natalie why she's sleeping in class because the teacher might see and kick us out for talking. Nat's gonna have to deal with catching up on everything she missed by herself. Hey, get it together, Natalie. Or come up with a hack. This little hack will allow you to be in two places at once. How? You'll need your glasses and a photo of yourself wearing glasses. One-to-one -one ratio so the proportions are right. Carefully cut out the rims and make sure your eyes are actually looking into the classroom. Now stick them inside the glasses. Just like that. Perfect. And there you have it. Natalie is now in two places at once. In class. And in her sweet, sweet dreams. Hopefully, it will only be the bell that wakes her. You can't use this hack if you sit up front. But that doesn't matter. Everyone knows that's where the nerds sit anyway. Everyone else can put this one to good use. 
we all know eating's not allowed in the classroom. But we'll just see about that. Just make sure you're careful, because facing the wrath of the teacher is not exactly fun. So, here's what we're gonna do. Use your preferred writing utensil to poke a hole in the bag. Stick it between the desks, and voila! Snacks ready, and no one's gonna kick you out for indulging. Help yourself, girlfriend, before it's all gone. <gasps> Dealing with a particularly nosy teacher? Just camouflage the bag and enjoy your snack in peace. Crunch, crunch, and crunch. Sooner or later, that dreaded day is gonna come. The day when you get called up to the board and you're not ready. Don't freak out, though. There's always a way out. If you've practiced understanding your study partner, that is. Make sure you and your bud develop a system both of you understand. Yup. Both of you understand. <laughs> There's a million little tips, tricks, and hacks you could use. It just takes some time and practice. So don't get down on yourself if you can't get a good system going right away. Next time, you'll surely awe them all. Go back to your desk, Natalie. Come on, Ashley. Show them how it's done. Check out this multiplication hack. If you need to multiply each number by nine, write down zero to nine in order, top to bottom. Then again, but bottom to top in the second column. If that's not magic, I don't know what is. Okay, so math can be pretty strange at times. And it's definitely best to know the multiplication tables by heart. But just look at that. Still pretty cool, right? Just look at the way those numbers align. Seriously, who would have thought that you could just write them in order like that? This is seriously amazing! Seven. Eight, nine. I'm a genius. Hey, Ben. Can I borrow your stapler? Sure, go for it. Thanks for letting me know it's broken. This little life hack will save you money and get you some creativity points. Grab a utility knife and make a cut going through all the sheets, stopping before the edges. Repeat. Now bend the edge and now your sheets ain't going anywhere. Whoa. I am clearly sitting next to a genius. Ew. Feeling the need to express your love? There's nothing to it. Unless there are no scissors around. This one goes out to all those stubborn souls that refuse to give up. Grab two rulers. Mm. And 
use their sharp edges instead of scissors. Perfect! Aww, such a sweet gesture. First heart is for the one that helped us out, of course. Gratitude is super important, after all. This has been Too Cool for School. Try out our hacks and let us know how they work out for you down in the comments. And make sure you hit that subscribe button. See you soon!